this is a good a day as any to start the rebuilding of life. The roads that lay open are many. When the old one's gone under the knife And I can feel the sun on my skin The skin is the teeth It's a beautiful day oh, I slept so good, I felt like we were in a marina It's so hot So calm Look at the water. I could wake up here every day. Wow. It looks like a lake. You can almost not see where the ocean ends and the sky starts. It's such a perfect day for water sports. <sighs> such a perfect day. Right? We're gonna finally try that sea bob. Yeah. I mean, how many years we've been looking at those sea bobs and never really had a chance to do it. I know. So stoked about it. And it's so calm and it's so warm outside. Because there's no breeze at all. No. No wind. <sighs> you know, that kind of weather sucks for the crew because you have to work in it. But it's really nice weather to be a guest. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Because you can just go like in and out of the water every five minutes, jump back in, come back out, have a drink, have a snack, go back in. It's like the most amazing vacation weather when it's just calm, hot, and you have beautiful water all around. Right. Is breakfast ready? Yeah. Is everyone waiting for me? Yeah. No. Yes. Oh no. No, let's go. You can have a tea. Okay, fine. Just a sip. It's really hot. What else are we doing today? We're gonna do the sea bob, snorkeling, yeah. swimming. If you want to stand a paddleboard. Definitely want to stand a paddleboard. Look at the water. It's like asking for it. Let's go. Let's have breakfast. At first, I think I might need a swim. Okay, jump up, jump in the water. Cool Seriously? off. I've always yeah. wanted to do that. Yeah, why not? Okay, I've always wanted to do that. I'm gonna put my bikini on. supposed to float. Yeah. That's life, right? I want every morning to be like this. Are you going next? Yeah. Okay. Let's have breakfast. Okay. Drink orange juice? For sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm. Alright, I guess we should tell you mm -hmm. where the heck we are. I think that would be a good start. Paradise. And how did this all happen? Yeah, I was representing a client of mine who bought a Sunreef 60 catamaran in Spain mm -hmm. and this boat was put on on the transport and just a few days ago came in to, to Florida Fort Lauderdale yeah and we got invited to actually be guests on this yacht which I always say we love what we do when we come and do charters here but it would be so nice to do it once as like a real vacation <laughs> and not and not have to work from the early morning to late evening not that we don't like it but it just would be nice yeah. to experience what it feels like yeah so we're here and the bahamas to be specific and actually in the exumas which is our favorite location cruising location in the world at least so far and it's gonna charter here in the bahamas it's available for charter and we are the first guests the i first guess charter guests. what is this called um the maiden no 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 when it's like a first run but it's like the hard rest we're like the soft, soft opening. opening for the for the bahamas <laughs> <laughs> so we get to try all the amazing food and actually show the crew which is met mediterranean based a uh, crew to to see what the bahamas are like so we get to show them some of our favorite spots and it's been it's been a really 
cool experience. We've been on it for a few days. We actually got to transfer it from we Florida. We were part of the crossing. We were part of the crossing from Florida all the way out here. It took about 26 hours and was a lot of fun actually going through the night and crossing over to Nassau. Yeah, so today we get to show you a day aboard of Valentine. Oh yeah, and it's a beautiful day. Super calm, as you guys can see behind us, like there's not a single wave, pretty much no wind. And the sun is luckily blocked at the moment from a cloud because it's really warm and we can't wait to go back into the water. So enjoy this one regular day aboard of sailing yacht Valentine. Should we show everybody the boat? I mean, at least a little. Yeah. Wow, there's an echo. Echo, echo, echo. I don't hear one. You don't hear it? No. It's like echoing everywhere. This um, bow is so massive that it's got its own echo. <laughs> okay, we'll give you a quick, not a true Naughty Styles tour. Naughty Styles on vacation tour. Naughty Styles on vacation tour, exactly. <laughs> okay, we have so many lounge spots on this boat. It's just a perfect charter yacht because of it. It is ridiculous. I mean, it is set up for eight guests. Eight. Mm -hmm. But the exteriors and all the hangout areas are like set up for 30. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I feel too. So we have layout area here. We have a layout area here. I can't roll everywhere. That's <laughs> pretty ridiculous. Lay area here. Here. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Stop me. Well, okay. you gotta keep going now. Okay. Then we have a really nice sitting area here. I feel like I have been the only person to enjoy it. There's just so much space. Like we all just spread out. And we still have the massive flybridge and the aft cockpit, but we show it to you. Yeah, I feel like the boys have been upstairs sailing and I don't know, doing their helmy things. And I just, I've been enjoying this space here. Underway, it's really nice because it doesn't have nearly as much wind. Sometimes you get a good amount of wind, especially if you're, you know, you've got good wind to sail. On the flybridge, it's, it could be a little breezy, but here it's just super nice. So we have a little cocktail table here. I think tonight might be the night that we can do some uh, watching the stars from here. Yeah. Because it's so calm, right? Just hanging out, it completely clears. So, what we love about the Sun Beef, which we haven't got to experience on the anchor until this week, is this forward facing door which connects the salon to this ridiculous bow. So come on in. I gotta say, that door has been a lifesaver because it's been so, so warm. Of course we have air conditioning, which we can run here, but if you don't want to, you just open up the door. You've got a little bit of breeze. You open up all these doors here. It's still early, so we, today is just so flat and beautiful. As I told you guys, which is why we're looking forward to doing all of the water sports today. Me too. Yeah, but <laughs> it's definitely a day that you can turn on the AC, close up all the doors, and really have a nice, nice cool space in here to cool off. So, the galley. Which we don't have to work in at all. Which is, it's been a little weird, because we're not used to that. <laughs> it's been really nice, but we had to sort of work on accepting the you know being waited on because we're just so not used to that i mean it's sort of expected when you walk into a restaurant when we are on board of a yacht rico and i we used to be in a crew so it's very different for us and it's very nice too but it's very strange <laughs> it's just strange that's probably the best the best word to describe it but the crew has been amazing the food has been amazing it's um well here's a little bit of the food
I saw some pre prep yesterday. Oh, were they the crab? I think it was, it was the, the, crab uh, the crab claws. claws. We have and the so pasta. We, oh, is it the, the crab pasta? Oh, my God. Crab pasta <laughs> with wine sauce. <laughs> okay. So the galley is not my galley, but I will give you a tiny tour. We have an induction cooktop, a microwave, a full-size oven here. We have a dishwasher, we have a sink, tons of storage. The TV pops out from here. We have not watched any TV on this trip whatsoever because why would you? Why would so we watch TV? Beautiful. <laughs> I mean, but I can there's see our TV right there. Yeah. But I could see that if it was a really rainy day, you know, just sitting here, close all the blinds, have like a really nice movie night. Yeah, that would be nice. Oh, and of course, we have a giant fridge, which is stocked to the max. Wow. For us fatties. I didn't have to provision that. <laughs> and hey, so, hey, wait, 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 wait. And most importantly, a coffee maker. Espresso, coffee. Cappuccino, love it. Oh, Rock, and, 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 and wine fridge. We have a bar here as well, a table. Actually, I've done a little bit of editing here. Uh, we were underway doing a, a longer crossing and I did work here. It was really, really nice. Yeah. But I feel like everyone else has just been hanging out in the cockpit and the fly bridge. Yeah. God, the spaces are enormous. <laughs> it, it, it's crazy. I mean, really, like the lounging, lounging spots on this boat are endless. When you tour this boat, you think like, wow, that's a lot of boat, but actually being on it for a week, it is still a lot of boat. Yeah. It, nothing's changed. Yeah. Like it doesn't feel like, oh, actually when you're fully on it. Yeah, I think if you had eight people, you would feel more. We definitely a bit less, but it still is so, so roomy. I mean, you literally have to look for each other. For sure. <laughs> All right, we're gonna show you our cabin. Yeah, don't waste the air conditioning. This is Mariko makes me tea in the morning. Nice thing about having a crew is you come back to your cabin and it's been beautifully made. Just after breakfast. I feel <laughs> like is, I feel like we're it's in a so weird. like five star hotel. It's so nice. Yeah. So this is our beautiful master that we are privileged to stay in. We have all the storage above. We have a, the one behind I you. know, we have a storage space here. There's a little getting ready thing, which is kind of nice to be able to just get out of each other's way mm -hmm. and have space. There is an out port storage on this side. All of this. I mean, this counter is really long. And we have a closet. Walk-in closet. Yeah. And we have an ensuite, which is really, really nice size. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Fresh ropes. <laughs> right. We have a really good size sink, countertop on each side, tons of storage. Well, that's really deep storage too. Yeah. The shower is pretty fabulous. Definitely a two-person shower. A really generous two-person shower. I mean, I can fit up here. It's so big. Yeah, we can shower together. Ah, okay. <laughs> no, it's very, it's a very comfortable master stateroom. And how about the I'm view? Not. How about the view out of the head? I mean, not when you're on the head, but when you're getting ready and you look in the mirror, you see this water behind you. I mean, yeah. it's pretty ridiculous. So nice. Really nice. Okay, let's keep going. We're gonna show you another guest stateroom. This one is not being used on this trip, so it's nicely made up. I can show it to you when other ones are being used, so keep them private. Washer and dryer is in here. In the works. Yeah, washing something. Okay. Hello. I know nobody's in there. Nobody's in there. So this is one of the guest staterooms. They're all about the same size. This one might be a smaller one. There's another guest stateroom that's even larger. We have also a generous amount of storage on outboard storage here. Behind Rico, there is a hanging locker. No. <laughs> we also have hatches, which we didn't mention. There's a hatch overhead here. There's a porthole here, which is nice breeze coming from. And in our head, 
we have a bit of a storage here. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's an yeah. outlet. Yeah, exactly. Super cute. And a really good size shower as well. Oh, that's still very comfortable. Yeah. With, with a rain shower head as well. One person shower, but great size. What you really need on vacation, you're not going to spend that much time exactly. in you your just, stateroom. Just sleep and get ready. Yeah. All right, should we show you the exterior? Let's go. More lounging spots. In another lounge spot for one, two, three, four people. <laughs> a whole family. This has been used a lot on this trip, mm -hmm. right? It's nice underway because it's completely wind free in case you don't like the breeze. Yeah, when it's like really rough outside, this is definitely very yeah, protected. Yeah, really spot. nice to protect it. It's also really nice at night because you have this beautiful lighting here so you can true, hang out true, true. after dinner and chill. Yeah. And you guys seen our dining room? I mean, one seen of our the, dining table? One, one of, of the dining tables. One of them. The smaller one. Yes, <laughs> the smaller one. And then over there is the entrance to the crew area and here we have our downstairs bar lower deck bar because mm. <laughs> we have two bars so there's a bar here there's a fridge and there's an ice maker there's a sink what i really like about it it's totally going on our mbb list look at this thing we've got an ambient so um room temp water chilled water and sparkling water all coming out of the same faucet yeah that's tap. really cool yeah we've used it all the time. Fill up all water bottles every day. Every day. Fly bridge. Wait, what about this? No, what about this? What about all this? Another lounging spot. When the tent is in the water. Yeah, the tent is in the water right now, and this awesome thingy is going all the way down. The swim step goes all the way into the water, which I'm looking forward to uh, showing you today. Should we go? Yes. Okay. All right, let's show you the fly bridge. Yeah. I would say the best part, but I really don't know. The bow is rivaling it. Well, hi guys! Hi. 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 Are you having cocktails already? It's not even <laughs> noon, but it's 5 o'clock somewhere. Thank you! Cheers! Cheers! Cheers, guys! Taking a little uh, drink break, back to the tour. So we have an even bigger dining table up here. <laughs> dining table for 25. <laughs> <laughs> Tons of sitting areas. No, here. but honestly, like, no kidding. That, that's a dining table for easy 10 people. Then we have the second bar that I told you guys about, also with a fridge and an ice maker. There's a sink up here, everything you need to do a proper bar service. And another lounge spot and the second matching one on the other side. So yeah, I don't know what, I don't know which spot is the best spot, but there are a lot of spots to be a favorite. I think the Flybridge is my favorite. Yeah? Yeah. You haven't set up here? No. You've just been around there, whatever you guys do here. Around, around here. Yeah. Even on vacation, he just cannot let go of the helm. Captain might be mad at him a little. He's been at the helm way too much for a guest. <laughs> so there you guys have it. This is the flybridge. This was real, real nice, but I am definitely getting in the water now. See you in a moment. Excited? Yeah. So how does wish, it work? Wish me luck. No, I want I want you to explain to people how it works. How cool is this platform? I mean, it's ridiculous. Love it. Okay. So here you can select your intensity here, mm -hmm. and then the gas is here. Oh, okay. Careful, it's gonna run yeah, away yeah. from you. Yeah, and that's it. You just hold on that's for dear it? for dear life, I guess. And I heard your shorts might fly off. Let's see what happens. Okay. Wish me luck. All right. Okay. 
go with the ball. Oh, that's fun. Bye! I Wait wonder if you're supposed to have fins on. You don't need fins, for what? Yeah, I guess. For better go steering. I love this. This is awesome. How does it feel? It's so cool. You don't need any effort to go underwater. Really? Is it easy? It's super easy. Anyone can do it? Super easy. You just put your belly on here yeah. and you hold onto this handles here like this. Yeah. And then you have this little gas pedal here with your hands yeah. on your right hand. And that's it. And what then if you, you don't have a belly? You still do the same thing. And then you press the pedal. That is so cool. the handles and here's the gas here put your hands in here put your hands in there yeah that's it and hold on one or both? just one pull it oh dude that's strong i'm gonna lose my bikini it's not that strong how long I was I mean look at the distance yeah you were like all the way from over there from our neighbors all the way down here pretty which much which are by the way huge Naughty Stars fans what yep no way is this going on NBB list two 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 I'm wondering if it's twice do you think there's an even more performance one probably huh I mean this thing is amazing I feel like I can hold my breath for like 10 minutes in this thing super fun it's so cool to see you underwater like right here because it's so clear you can see you crystal clear really yeah oh like from above oh it's incredible you want, want me to go on another flyby sure oh. Oh. Don't, don't sink it babe what are you doing here <laughs> soaking up the very last of this beautiful day because it's what your everyday would look like if you would be a guest aboard a valentine such a paradise oh. i love that sea bob <laughs> you want one now oh, i want two now i want like a high performance one to race each other yeah <laughs> just need to get a different mask probably different goggles or something because at some point i think they're gonna fly off or they're gonna push your nose flat yeah i don't think that i don't think that works Oh, just leave me here. Pick me up in a couple of months. Cocktails? Sure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. Okay. Hi, Lola. Thank you. So wait, did you find all these? Yeah. How did you find the log? Actually, it was already here. Oh. <laughs> Not a coconut? Yeah, the coconut I found. Well, it doesn't seem like that much wood on the beach for some reason. I guess a lot of people been I guess bring it off. People burned it away. So we're gonna have to. Uh, these palm leaves are gonna have to do. But hey, it's not too shabby of a view. Hello, let me sit with Mama. Pretty nice sunset. Someone's very happy. <laughs> very happy. Hello. So. This is our yacht, this is our neighbor's yacht. And we just met and they're actually joining us for our little get together here that we're having. This is Lola. Hello. Yeah, Marco was pretty happy to meet somebody else other than a human. Ooh, that looks better. Yeah. A lot better. Actually, we, um, I built this like a year ago. Oh, you did? Yeah. <laughs> it's been there for a year. <laughs> yeah. I mean, people must have been using it, but um, we built it about a year ago. Okay, I'm gonna go get some more, some more palm leaves because I think that little pile is gonna burn off real quickly. 
When you can do stuff like this, you forget about everything else happening in the world. You forget about COVID, you forget about wars. You're just in a moment, in a moment, really, really present. It's pretty special. I think it takes to go to a deserted place to feel that way. So we keep coming back to, to this place because it makes us feel special. Sort of our paradise. A place that you just forget about everything else. I mean, can you just look at this? We still have dinner coming up. <laughs> this is just a little pre-dinner fun. Look how round this rock is. Look at this. Oh wow, yeah. It's really pretty. Let's see if I can still do this. This morning I was so clear a lot as I need To see the horizon and the far Excuses were too for a penny But they've all gone out the window of this car And when I My face All that ever was Is a That was, that was one day, one day, one day aboard Valentine. Yeah. And tomorrow we get to do it all over again. Not the same day. We get, we, what, what are we doing tomorrow? We go, tomorrow we're actually going to the pigs and going to Thunderbolt Grotto. Yep. And going to Check out tide pools. Going to stay on Kia Club for dinner. So tomorrow day is going to be very, very different. Yeah. But we wanted to show you the experience that it's not just excursions and you know the things that you come to the Exumas for. And it's delicious food and it's bonfires on the beach and it's crystal clear water and sea bob. Man, that sea bob. I need to get one. Uh, what was your favorite part about not being crew aboard of a yacht? Not having to cook every single meal. I do enjoy cooking, but if it's always and every meal, it becomes a little of a chore. 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 Okay, anything else? Um, Being able to play in a water for hours and not have to yeah. worry about the guests being that's, entertained? That's, that's pretty cool too, um, yeah, for sure. That's but I do enjoy taking people to places we, we like and we enjoy and um, it's I think it's very rewarding to share that. I agree. If we didn't enjoy it, we wouldn't do it. So exactly. we obviously enjoy it. Yeah. This just felt like a different type of experience, like a break, um, just an opportunity to sort of not worry about anyone else having fun, which is normally what we do. Anytime somebody comes on the charter with us, we want them to have like the most amazing trip. We want them to have so much fun. And sometimes that obviously puts a little bit of stress on us that we want to make sure that yeah. everyone's really happy and everyone's different. Everyone has different ideas of what, what vacation is like. So it's it's a bit of a balance. And it was nice to just not have to think about anyone else, but sort of ourselves. Yep. Um, I guess being a little selfish for a moment felt like a real vacation. So that was uh, that was really cool. I really enjoyed someone else putting toys in the water for me. Well, that's true. <laughs> Can I get a paddleboard? No I didn't. Problem. I didn't have to throw paddleboards in and pick them back up and secure them on the lifelines and blah blah blah. Like all and that, that stuff. swim step. <sighs> amazing. That was really, amazing. really cool. Yeah, that was awesome. Loved it. Anything that being else said, that loved? let's get some cocktails. Oh yeah, we're gonna have some cocktails, and we'll say bye to you, maybe from maybe, from, from, from the bed. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed your our day, your day. Hope, hope you guys enjoyed joining our day. The day with us. 
as always please like subscribe and comment we really appreciate you guys doing it and we'll see you on the next one check us out on patreon check us out on instagrams maybe there were some outtakes so, enjoy the outtakes ciao <laughs> bye good night good night One day, what? <laughs> that was. That was. I mean, if it if it wasn't if we didn't if. <sighs> what? Where are we? <sighs> There's a little breeze right now. It's so <laughs> nice. <laughs> what? <gasps> oh. Precock. <laughs> Bitch, I thought you said <laughs> you're like hey hey look at look, you guys look at my point of view I mean there's this guy but uh, yeah you can't see the water I know nice comment huh? <laughs> <laughs> you can be like, like what nope. is with this guy that keeps wanting to drive my boat <laughs> That is fast. Yeah? Yeah, really fast. <laughs> I had to run from one side to another. All right, I'm um, guessing yeah, I'm not getting back on that thing. I'm gonna stay in the water forever. All right, have fun, bye-bye. Look, he wants to go back, Rico. Marco, no, hey, come here. That's not our dinghy, come on. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Does he like to swim? No. Oh. I think he wants to go back to the boat. <laughs> Something in my foot. Looked like someone yeah. shot you. Oh. Oof. Like a spiky thing? Oh, yeah. That was really sharp. Okay, let's go.